So a quick update then on Band of Air. We are working on a Band of Air change. It is a substantial change to the Band of Air mechanics, as well as actually Band of Darkness as well, too. Um, Robert has been specifically working um, on that very closely and paying a lot of attention to it. The gist is, is that Band of Air um, does proc off of things that it is not expected to be procking off. It is allowed to proc off a wide variety of what the internally call powers. Um, to players, however, it's not like everything you might think is a power. It's not like just, oh, every at will or every encounter is brought. There's actually a number of other things in our engine that count as powers. Right now, Band of Air can proc off of a lot of powers. Not even just your powers. Sometimes they can proc off of interesting setups for things like companions and other things that they are not well, that we were basically not expecting it to. Uh, the net result is that Band of Air procs off of a lot of things it shouldn't, and as a result, it procs much more often than was originally expected. So there is going to be a substantial change to Band of Air coming up here in the near future, probably before our next major release, that will drastically change its procking behavior and will likely overall substantially reduce its, its total damage output. There's no easy way to say that, but Band of Air currently functions way beyond its expected parameters in terms of what we want out of the best in slot ring. And our goal is to ensure that the future version of Band of Air is still the best in slot ring, and that hopefully the Band of Darkness is also more competitive and interesting. But at the same time, it is no longer catastrophically beyond sort of the expected item slot budget. Um, there's nothing that's sort of all on us. It's egg on our face for for messing up the Band of Air in terms of how it uh, how it was mechanically set up and these issues that we've hit but we feel it's important because you know in its current state band of air will be the best in slot ring for probably forever because we don't plan on ever making a ring that powerful ever again so there's something that we have to do about it we compare it directly you know, we're comparing its performance directly against other very strong rings like the red eyes glare and things like that and we still expect it to be better than those other available options it takes a lot of effort to get one and it needs to be um, very strong as a result of that and it will remain the best in slot ring but this is unfortunately one of those few cases where um, other than sort of improving Ring of Darkness to try to make it more competitive, there's not a lot we can do since Band of Air was already in a tier of its own, but we need to bring it down a couple of tiers so that it's only a slight tier above other other very high quality rings in the game and not many, many tiers above other quality rings in the game. So that change, again, expect that to happen, my guess is sometime in the next month. So there and you heard it. The Band of Air is most likely going to be the most powerful ring they will ever introduce to the game, even after the nerf. So start farming it, and eventually they're going to make the drop rates even better. So eventually every single one of you will have the best ring in the game. So yeah, like I said a minute ago, you better start farming it. Galactic here, peace out, stay safe.